Good morning, Greater Love Church family. Listen, I greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I am excited uh, to make this video for you. I am still here at the church. It's a Saturday night, and I am here because I love you, and there's absolutely nothing that you can do about it. Uh, I'm making this video because I am currently in Rocky Mount. While you're listening to this video, I am now in Rocky Mount. Uh, getting ready to preach for Bishop Shelton Daniel, Greater Joy of Rocky Mount. Uh, the great Luther Barnes is opening up for us, and then after he ministers, I will preach the Word of God. I am so excited that God has given me this opportunity. Uh, and so I just wanted to come and talk to you. Uh, for those of you who are here at 9 o'clock, I want you to look over to your left. I want you to look over to your left. Um, Brother Chad Evans is here with us. Today is his last day. Chad, I want to say to you, man, um, that I love you, man. You've been a great son in this ministry. And um, I'm going to be here at 1130 uh, to properly salute you and all of the great things that you've done here for these many years. Okay, church family, listen, uh, we've got three uh, awesome preachers that are getting ready to approach the pulpit uh, in the name of Minister James Isaac. Then we have Elder Cheryl Haynes. And then behind her, we have Minister Robin Patterson. All of these are very capable. They are very capable preachers. Uh, this is actually Minister uh, Isaac's first time preaching here. So in a sense, you can call it his initial sermon. I want you to get behind all three of these great preachers and push them. I know where they're going. Uh, we've talked about it. Uh, they have studied the text, and I believe that God will use them in a phenomenal way to bring forth a phenomenal word. All right? Um, I'm excited about the 1130 service, our Shades of Blue. Get ready and sing because I will be back. I don't want to miss that moment. And then I'll also be ready to preach at our 1130 service. So with that being said, live, laugh, love, ride until the wheels fall off. If they fall off, God told me to tell you, pick them back up, put them back on again. I decree and declare victory in every area of your life. And it's not God's will that you have victory without having peace. So along with that victory, I pray that God will give you peace in every room of your house and everywhere you go. Make this a phenomenal day. And always remember, I love you. And there is absolutely nothing you can do about it. God bless you.